Hello there, welcome to Photography Japan. Today we have the Panasonic Lumix S5 Mark II X. And we have this for three weeks now. But now we are going to take it to the biggest festival in Northern Saitama Prefecture, which is the Uchiwa Matsuri or the Uchiwa Festival. And we are going to talk about what I like with this new Panasonic full frame camera. Let's go. So as we are walking towards the main area of the celebration, you can see this traditional cart is going to be pulled uh, in a matter of a while going there and around uh, the city perhaps. And uh, each one of this has a representation of a god of the Shinto religion. Okay, the first thing that I like about the S5 Mark II X is that it has everything that I like about the S5, the original S5, including the good handling and its overall looks. The usability is easy, intuitive menu, and of course, I came from the Nikon system, so it's like seamless when you change from Nikon going to Panasonic. We are here at Kumagaya Station and this is the main uh, arriving point of all the visitors that come here. But hundreds of thousands of people come here during the Uchiwa Matsuri. The second thing that I like about this camera is that the black color, you cannot say that it's not cool, it's really looking tough. By the way, I'm using now, for the first time, the Sigma 28 to 70 mm 2.8. And I don't know if it's going to work, but initially, it works perfectly well. I hope you can see the statue on my back, riding that horse. That is Naozanek Kumagai, in which this city is named after. So he is like a hero, number one. But the number three thing that I like about the M2X is that the face detect autofocus is so much better than the old autofocusing system of the S5. So it works perfectly well that when we used it in Tokyo and I touched the record, and it recorded while it was hanging uh, on my neck. And it just keeps on focusing everything that it sees. So it works properly and very, very perfectly, I should say. If you need something for professional videography, it's like you have so many choices. But it's kind of difficult to find one because it's, there is a long list actually of codecs and sometimes I get lost. Maybe I'll get used to it. And one more thing about the video is that the HDMI is now full size. The 
this is going to be the center of the exhibition for the final showdown of the traditional cars that they're pulling. It will be assembled here. One of the things that I like about this camera is that it is capable to record on an SSD. You just plug in the USB-C here and then you can record ProRes. The editing process will be much, much easier. You just pull the SSD and put it in your computer. At this point, we were literally fighting for space just to even raise arms to take shots. It was chaotic. The sound when they all play together in their own pace is quite mind-breaking, I should say. I felt dizzy, so I tried to get away from the crowd. It took me 10 minutes to get out of the chaos. I also lost my cameraman. Are we now at number six? If it's number six, number six is that it still uses the SD card format. All the other major companies are now using the Flash CF Express card. So it's quite expensive now that you can use the SD card, still very good. And both card slots are now UHS2 certified, so it's quite good. And finally, the festival is over and we are really exhausted. We're sitting here nicely on these rocks in the middle of the street just to have a breather. And because it's final, we're going to have to give you our last of what we like of the Panasonic Lumix S5 Mark II X. And that's the capability of this camera to be used as a webcam. If you want to broadcast live on the internet, there is a way to do it. We haven't tried it yet, but because it's there, it's really a good idea. We originally intended to do a video that will tell you what we like and we don't like about the Panasonic Linux S5 Mark II X. Unfortunately, we don't have time. It was so busy and it was so crowded. So in the next video, we're going to tell you what are the things that we actually don't like on this camera so until then thank you for watching and i'll see you again on the next one goodbye